I'm Christy Johnson, soul health coach and author of Love Junkies, Seven Steps for Breaking the Toxic Relationship Cycle. Today on Soul Fit, we're going to talk about something I hear women complain about all the time. In fact, I used to wonder the same thing myself. Why can't I find a decent man? Where have all the good guys gone? They must be living in submarines or on Pluto, but they're not here. Can you relate? Have you ever said any of those things? I used to have an invisible magnet on my forehead. Put me in a room full of a thousand guys and somehow I'd wind up with the loser. I was so unlucky at love. But experience has been good to me. I may be a slow learner, but over the course of the next several videos, I'm going to share with you some of the secrets to finding true love that I've learned the hard way. I don't want you to be like I once was. I don't want you to give up the hunt because you don't think that the one you want exists. I don't want you to compromise and settle for a relationship that is less than what you've always hoped for. Ladies, it's time to break the toxic relationship cycle. Experts say that we gravitate towards others within a 10 point spread of our own IQ. In other words, we're most naturally comfortable around others that share our same intellect. Likewise, if we could measure our soul health, the same principle applies. We attract who we are. Put another way, and I'm just going to come out and say it, and I hope you don't get offended, but baggage attracts baggage. When we have issues in our lives that have not been resolved, issues with hope and trust, issues with past hurts, even issues about our purpose in life, it makes us a magnet to unhealthy relationships. Unresolved issues in our own lives create a vulnerability in us that make us susceptible to compromise, and we end up in unfulfilling, toxic relationships that don't satisfy. But the healthier our soul is, the healthier our relationships become. In other words, the best way to improve the health of your relationship or your future relationship is to improve your own soul health. So do you want to get soul fit? Ladies, it's easier than you think, and that's what soul fit is all about. So I want you to join me on this video journey as we explore ways to improve our soul health and avoid the toxic love rut. Next, I'm going to talk about the number one mistake women make in relationships, so don't miss it. You can also read more at christyjohnson.org. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time on Soul Fit.